Sutra Mall. Hello everyone, today we are going to take a look at Sutra Mall. There is this fantastic bakery called Baburna. It is looking to hire if you are interested. The inside of the bakery seems very classy. I came in the morning time so there are a lot of freshly baked breads. Chinese New Year stuff can also be seen as well. Price for the bread items are also very cheap. As far as I can see, there are at least 50 different types of breads on the shelves. And they all look super fresh and delicious. Even for me who is not a bread person, I had the urge to just grab 10 of them and start sinking my teeth into them. I also found their cake to be very very cheap. 1 kilo cakes only cost 88 ringgit, it is at least double elsewhere. I got ahead and buy myself a slice of crepe cake. The box that came with it is pretty too. There you go, there is even a transparent sheet to protect its shape. The cake looked really good and big. It cost 8 ringgit. I highly recommend you go and try. It's really value for money. Let's continue to check out Sutra Mall, as there are many exciting areas in it. Like the Hong Kong street in the basement, you can see many elements of Hong Kong. Comment below and tell me what the name of these characters are. If you like to shop at smaller brands, the basement is a great place to start. You can always find surprises as you slowly discover more areas. You can easily walk a whole afternoon and you still will be able to find new shops in Sutra Mall. I'm not sure why but there is a mini Japanese theme that can be found everywhere. And every now and then there are anime exhibitions being held in the main hall. I made a video coverage before that you can check it out in the link above. That event was quite impressive, there were a lot of vendors and participants. Now we move on to the ground level which has the main event hall and bigger brands that you can recognize. Currently there is a Chinese New Year show going on. By the time this video is up on YouTube, you'll still be able to come and visit it in time. There are lots of promotions and items that you probably cannot get in everyday shops. I'll leave the address in the description box below. Be sure to check it out. There is also Aeon, a very large supermarket on the second floor. It has everything that you need. To be honest, sometimes I just like to walk around in supermarket even if I don't have anything to buy. Do any of you also do that? Let me know. Today is the last day of 2022 so there still aren't many people doing Chinese New Year shopping yet. I suggest you prepare for crowd when you decide to come after watching this video. If you are planning to take a taxi instead of driving yourself, a parking spot can be hard to find. I have provided 3 apps in the description box below that I recommend you to use. If you find this video useful for you, please give me a like and subscribe to the channel. It will really help me a lot to produce more videos in the future. That is all I have for you today. I hope you have a wonderful day ahead. Bye-bye.